Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of April 19th through the 25th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. Some people don't understand that not every reading is for them. Some people do. Not every reading is for you. So keep that in mind. What do we have for a message today? Six months. Unrequited love. Scorpio. Aries reversed. Interesting. I'm going to make it up right, but uh, you may not be in your element right now, but you should be because it's still Aries season, but we are going out of Aries season this week. We go into Taurus. Um, you may not be feeling like yourself this week as we're going through a switch. And it's interesting because Scorpio is on the opposite spectrum of Taurus. We do have an unrequited love situation from the past. We do. Six months in the past, something has happened six months ago. It may make you angry. It could come up this week because the Scorpio is a stinger. This one came out and reversed. may make you angry. So I'm wondering if something that happened six months ago is going to pop up this week. It could, because the Aries came out reverse, could make you really, really, really angry. Phone call that changes everything. Interesting. They will not change ever. You're obviously dealing with somebody that is extremely stubborn. Extremely. All right. It says they will not change ever. So you're dealing with somebody that's extremely stubborn. They are never going to change. You may have been trying to get somebody to change. It's an unrequited love situation. And you're either, I feel like you're dealing with a Taurus or a Scorpio. Maybe even another Aries. Ooh, clean slate in the future. And it's next to you. So you will be starting with a clean slate. You may be dealing with somebody where there is nothing there. There's nothing there at all. You may be in the darkness or they may be in the darkness. There's some sort of darkness here, but this is also a clean slate starting fresh. You have the ability to create whatever you want. You may have to uh, accept something. It hurts, obviously. It stings. I think that there's... You're probably feeling a little uneasy and out of your element over something that happened. Maybe it was a phone call that happened six months ago. Whoever you're dealing with is not going to change. Okay, they're not going to change their mind. So maybe you need to stop investing in them. A message is coming that you do not want to hear. And maybe, maybe, maybe you're getting it right now. I'm not sure. But I do believe that there is something that is happening that uh, started at least six months ago. Or, that, you know, that's when uh, things started to change. And I feel like you, it's an unrequited love situation that perhaps you need to acknowledge in some way. 
So what do we have? And I think that you're going to be dealing with it this week and feeling uneasy about yourself, not feeling in your element, maybe even feeling angry and upset, maybe even... Um, I don't know. It feels like it hurts. It feels like it feels like it hurts with that Aries card reversed. And sometimes when you're hurt, it can bring up anger. So I don't know if you're going to get angry, but um, anger is part of the grieving process. It is. So what do we have for Aries? And when I say grieving process, that doesn't mean that somebody it's grieving. When we lose somebody that we love. There's a grieving process that follows, whether they die or not. You know, we lost them from our lives for one reason or another. There's a grieving process that comes from that. Queen of Cups. So your challenge, and it came out sideways. You could, your challenge could be a water sign or it's somebody that is very back and forth, wishy-washy. Uh, plays on emotions. This person may communicate with you openly one minute because it's sideways. The next minute they don't communicate at all. This is somebody that is very all over the place, wishy-washy, uh, emotional or lack thereof, goes back and forth. Okay. I feel like, and, and maybe, you know, this per there's some sort of uh, issues with their ability to express their emotions. Um, they express them one minute, they're all in love, and the next minute they're not, okay? This person may seem withdrawn at times. They don't know what they want emotionally. You're dealing with somebody that uh, may be uh, vindictive. This person may be shallow. They may see themselves as a victim. They may be very needy, or on other hand, on another hand, they could be self-loathing, or they could be too lovey-dovey. You know, it, it's just there's no balance with this person. Page of a message that you don't want to hear is coming. You're going to be receiving a phone call or you're going to be receiving a message. You could even be seeing something, you know, uh, that uh, surprises you. Uh, you're definitely dealing with an ass here. Somebody that is probably pretty emotionally immature. Uh, they could be just, uh, I do think because of the Queen of Cups, that's where the emotions are. This person uh, may act like a child at times they could be 72 years old you know it doesn't not it doesn't matter how old they are you know this person may be uh immature you know they may act they may play mind games they may be argumentative um you i feel like i mean unfortunately with the page of swords reverse there could be some news that that is coming it's definitely something that you don't want to hear you could also be hearing of some gossip you could be dealing with a gossip somebody that tells everybody everything that likes to cause problems uh you know you could also there could also be some psychological abuse here with the queen of cups reversed or sideways which is a challenge in the page of swords reversed i feel like you are in an unrequited love situation and it's and it's hard to uh start over it is hard to start over i do feel as though you are going to be starting over though if you're not starting over now, maybe it started maybe it started six months ago. In six months from now, you're going to be in a different place, a completely different place. Six months from now is October, okay? Um, there is a phone call that is coming that is going to change everything. Um, I feel like you're going to hear something that you don't want to hear or you're going to see something that you don't want to hear. I think that there's a troublemaker here and you could be you could be dealing with somebody even that has, you know, some a hard they obviously don't communicate well. This could be somebody that is very very secretive. Um we had two here. Guess not. Star reversed. So why is this happening? Why is this happening? It may have something to do with a child. Somebody could be receiving a message. Maybe it has to do with their child or something like that. Um, but the star card reversed is... Unable to heal. It 
could be some sort of poor health here, depression, arrogance. Why is this happening? You may be saying that. Why is this happening? You may be feeling depleted. There's some. I feel also as though there's some sort of poor health here. It's almost like there's poison because Scorpio, the stinger, is poison. There's some. It's like there's some sort of poison here. Um, why is this happening? I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is malicious, honestly. That is almost. It's almost like they're playing with your heart. Emperor reversed. Oh my goodness. Emperor reversed. So I feel like there could be some anger that comes out. I do. I feel like this week, you know, you're probably not going to be feeling like yourself. I feel like something is happening that is out of your control. I think you have an enemy in disguise. I do. I think that you have an enemy here. Page of Swords reversed is an, is being caught off guard by an enemy that is in disguise. You could be dealing. I feel like you're you're dealing with somebody that um is malicious. They are malicious. This person is not very spiritual. They don't have a lot of faith. They hold on to grudges because of this ass card. This is somebody that holds on to a grudge for their whole life. And they never give it up. think that you're dealing with somebody that um it feels like they're gonna do something it feels like they're doing something to take control to they have a control problem a control issue they don't want you to be in control they don't want you to be the boss they don't want you to be above them I feel like I feel like there's somebody here that is doing something that is against the law and I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you. Uh, maybe it's just the universal law. Um, but I do see that in the future you are going to be starting with a clean slate. The star comes after the tower. Unfortunately, this one is reversed. I, there's probably going to be an event that causes something to crumble. Um, but I don't feel like there's that, that help arrives or something has crumbled. It's like you're not going to be getting what you thought you were going to get. This is a lack of wish fulfillment because it, and it hurts really bad because that sting hurts. Somebody has been hoping for something. They may have been hoping for a clean slate with somebody, you know, uh, from the past. But they're dealing with another person that is very malicious. We have maliciousness here. I know that we do. And maybe you haven't seen it. Anyhow, I do believe that... Uh, I feel I gotta turn this around because I, have, I just have to. I feel like you're, this is turned upside down. Okay, so I be I believe that something is being turned around, you know, and probably going somebody's trying to turn something around back onto you. And I think it's because they want to cause disorganization. They want control. And they don't want you to be in power. They don't want you to make a decision. They don't want you. So they want to be in control. You're dealing with a control freak. And I feel as though this week you're going to get bit by them. Or you're going to get stung. Or there's some sort of, you know, I don't know. It feels like there's some sort of poison. You know what I mean? There's some sort of, uh, I 
manipulation here from this person. I feel like you got somebody here that's trying to manipulate you and try to manipulate your emotions or trying to manipulate you to do something that they want, that they want you know, or they don't want, you know, they're trying to control a situation. They'll do anything to control it. This is somebody that is very sneaky, extremely sneaky. This is a liar. It's a cheat. This is somebody that is very hostile. I feel like you, you, you are dealing with somebody that may present themselves to be your friend, but they're not. I feel like you're going to be receiving a message or you're going to be seeing something or that makes you ask why, 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 why. Four of Swords. The Four of Swords is the death of an idea, okay? The need to heal, a need to take a time out, take a break, exhaustion, tired, sickness, I, so, you know, so I, I think somebody could even end up going to the hospital. I just got to be honest. This is this could be, you know, this is painful. You see the 3 of swords there. Okay? This is a painful situation. I think I see suffering, I see pain, I see heartache, I see a need to heal, a need to uh recovery. A recovery is needed. A time to recuperate, time to uh, go within. I feel like that there is a message that is coming that you don't want to hear. This may have to do with an ending with this Four of Swords. I mean, this is, we may, I feel like we have somebody here that is very, very sick, unfortunately. I feel like there's, because there's, there's illness here. There is some sort of illness. I also, I also want to say don't drink the water. Don't drink anything that anybody, don't drink the water whatever that means don't drink it if don't drink anything that anybody gives you put it that way and i don't know what where, whose message that is but do not okay um i feel like uh there is going to be a need to heal okay there's healing that is needed and there's been a lack of healing and I feel like you you may be in a state of despair over some sort of news that you receive that stings. And that's the message that I have. And I do apologize. Somebody may be abandoning you. Okay. They may be ghosting you or leaving you out in the cold or something like that. There is definitely some sort of... If it almost feels like abolishment, but there's also victim mentality here. You you have a choice. You have a choice. You can choose to be a victim of this circumstance, or you can choose to go someplace else. Anyway, I feel like this week there's there's going to be some sort of uh, there's definitely poor health here. Uh, anyhow, I, I do feel like there's a need to, maybe you need to go to the doctors. You may need to go to the doctors. Maybe you need to get yourself checked out. Maybe you need just a time out from, from a situation that you have been investing in. You got to get this poison out of you, okay? There's some sort of poison in you that needs to be taken care of. You need to, what is it, what do they call that? Um... I don't even know what they do to take poison out of you. But anyhow, there's some sort of poison that is killing you. And you, because this is like the death of a person or idea. And this is poor health. And you need, you need to uh, heal from it. You do need to heal from it. Anyway, this week you're going to be, uh, it looks like you're going to be starting from scratch. You're probably going to be upset. I do, with that Aries card reverse, that's, that's, upset it's angry it's it's uh, out of your control there is something that is happening that is out of your control you're dealing with a very sneaky uh it feels like it's a dangerous individual 
Um, it does. If I mean, if you think about a scorpion, you know, uh, if, if once it bites you, it's bad. Okay, so I I, I feel like. Um, this week, you're going to need to go within and take a time out to heal from this sting, whatever it is. Good luck.